Hey guys, it's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. Today's deal comes to you from Walmart. Once again, we have some fantastic rebates at Walmart. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for clicking on this video. Feel free to hit the like button if you like seeing Walmart Ibotta hauls or if you like my cute little cat here, Gizmo. He's always in these videos when he's awake, inspecting everything. He likes to lick the plastic. He sometimes likes to talk and wrestle with different items. So I apologize if he is distracting, but he just loves being a part of these videos. If you're new to Ibotta, Fetch Rewards, Dabble, Shopkick, any of the rebate apps, I will leave the, the links to those in the description box below, as well as a link to a printable breakdown. So you guys can take that in the store with you and it will save you some time when you're doing your shopping. All right, so let's jump right into these fantastic deals. Now I was working with one Ibotta bonus and that was the browser extension bonus. So this popped up for me the other day randomly and it said that if I install a browser extension on a web browser on my computer for Ibotta, then I would get a $5 bonus when I redeemed any offer. And it didn't have to be through the browser, it could be through the app. So I did get my $5 bonus for that. So depending on what bonuses you have on your account and what you're working with, you may or may not end up with the exact same totals as me because accounts do vary. Alrighty, so the first thing I wanted to grab were these Pringle Scorchin' Chips. So I've had these several times, they are tasty. And they are $1.48, but Ibotta is giving us $1.98 back, making our final cost completely free plus a 50 cent money maker. And this is the second time I've grabbed this item. I tried this for the first time not long ago and really loved it. I would highly recommend if you like fried rice. So this is the brand Grain Trust, and they do have different kinds of rice, but I just liked the hibachi fried rice the first time, so I grabbed it again. So these are $2 in the frozen section, and Ibotta is giving us a dollar back, and Ibotta also gave me 10 cents back for buying any brand frozen entree, making my final cost just 90 cents. The mentholatum vapor duos are $4.98. You want to grab two of those, which would be $9.96, and mine had dollar peelies on them. Now, just a fair warning, if you haven't bought these already, the peelies do not work. They have to be manually entered. It's very bizarre to me that a coupon on the item doesn't work at the self-checkout, but they always give me issues, so the cashier pushed them through for me. So I used two $1 peelies. I paid $7.96 out of pocket, but then Ibotta gave me back $7 for buying two, making my final cost $0.96 cents for both. This is a new item for me, the Oatsum Organic Oat Milk. If you've tried this, let me know what you think of it. It was very hard to find, honestly. It was shoved behind some other things in my store. but. I love the Walmart app because it tells us exactly what aisle most of our items are in. So I knew I was in the right aisle and lo and behold, I finally found it. So this was priced at $2.92 at my store. And I bought it gave us $2.79 back, making my final cost just 13 cents. And here he is licking his plastic. He loves that. Someone told me that when cats lick plastic, it releases some kind of like feel good endorphins and hormones. So have fun, buddy. Okay, so I had to grab another one of these. These are the M&M's candy bars. Let's see if I can grab this without knocking things over. So the first time around, I grabbed the Krispies. This is the almond variety. So it's got like mini M&Ms in there and almonds. So I'm sure this is delicious and low calorie, right? So that little guy is priced at $1.68. Shopkick is giving us $1.32 back. When we scan the barcode of that item on the Shopkick app in the store and when we purchase the item, making our final cost just 36 cents. And be sure also to scan this into the coupons.com app because we do have a rebate on there. When we spend $10 on these items, we get $2 back and it tracks over time. And I think the final deadline to meet that $10 goal is like mid-March. 
So we've got some time, so be sure to scan that into your coupons.com app. I was so excited to see this deal because I love the opportunity to get free cards. So I, at my store, I found two of the Hallmark Valentine cards at, let me see, I wrote down the wrong total, I think. I wrote down 50 cents, but I think they were even cheaper than that. They're like 40, yeah, 47 cents a piece. So I scanned the barcode on the Ibotta app and sure enough, these qualify for the rebate. And you can see there, they're 47 cents a piece. So Ibotta is giving us $2 back when we buy two Hallmark Valentine cards. So these ended up being completely free plus a dollar and six cent money maker. And they're really cute cards for 47 cents. And he has accomplished knocking the brownie brittle over. <laughs> I am not surprised. Okay, so I was planning on getting this item, um, this Skippy peanut butter, because we have a completely free offer on Ibotta, but this deal turned out just incredible. So if you have these rebates, run and do this deal. The Skippy squeezable peanut butter, it's the six ounce pouch. These are $2.47 at my store. We have a dollar printable from coupons.com. I don't know if that's any longer available to print, but if you have printed that, it does attach to this item. So right there at the register, I'm just paying $1.47. But then Ibotta had a $2.49 rebate on any Skippy Squeeze peanut butter. Ibotta also had a 70 cent rebate for Skippy Spread, and this attached to the Skippy Spread rebate. And Ibotta gave us a dollar bonus for redeeming both of those Skippy rebates. So my final cost was not only free, but a $2.72 money maker. That's just unreal. Super excited about that. So if you have that coupon and those rebates, you could go in the store. You don't have to do this whole big deal if you don't want to. You could just grab this item and you will walk out of the store making $2.72. Crazy. This is why I love rebate shopping. I gotta pick up my mess here. Okay. So the next thing I got were the Chobani Flip yogurts. These are $1.22 each, and my store had this limited edition peppermint perfection. So I'm really excited to try that out. It says limited batch. Maybe it was made for the holidays, but. I grabbed one of those and then one of the mint chocolate chip and they're $1.22 a piece. So two of them would be $2.44, but then Ibotta had a rebate giving me $1.22 back for buying two and a separate 10 cents back on any brand kids yogurt, which attached to these. So my final cost ended up just $1.12 for both of these. And we go to the brownie brittle. This is apparently Gizmo's favorite item of the haul. It is really delicious. The Sheila Cheese brownie brittle. There's chocolate chip. I think there are some other varieties. This is $2.88. I didn't have any coupons, but Ibotta gave me a dollar back and Fetch Rewards gave me a dollar back, making my final cost just 88 cents. The Neutrogena Skin Balancing Micellar Cleansing Cloths. These are 25 towelettes. These are priced at $6.24. You want to use a $3 printable from coupons.com and I just printed one yesterday, so they should still be available. And then Ibotta gave me $2 back on this item, making my final cost just $1.24. And this is an item that I would use. So super happy to go from $6 to $1. Okay, and it's so much fun having cats, you guys. My cat, my other cat over here just stepped on the computer and just closed out my document. So I have to pull it back up so I can share my totals with you guys. <laughs> All right, here's another freebie and money maker if you have these Fetch Rewards rebates. So the bear, aspirin, the 32 count tablets. These are $2.24. I had two separate fetch rewards rebates. 
One was for $1.75 back on any bear, and the other was for $2 back on any bear. So my final cost was free plus a $1.51 money maker. And the Nivea Men Cream is a deal I've done several times. So this is the 2.6 ounce cream. Now, if you have on your coupons app, a Nivea, it's lotion or cream coupon for $2.50 back, you'll definitely want to use that coupon. You'll want to redeem your receipt and get your $2.50 back. I have already done that. And I didn't have any coupons that worked on this item but Ibotta gave me $2.50 back. So the item is $2.97. After my Ibotta rebate, I ended up paying just 47 cents, which is still an amazing deal. And I also grabbed some Nivea breathable lotion. So this is the Fresh Fusion. There's also like a tropical scent. Sorry that that's not focusing super great. Um, but this is 13 and a half fluid ounces. And I specifically grabbed the breathable lotion because we have a great Ibotta rebate for that one. So this is priced at $5.48. I used a $2 coupon from the 131 Smart Source. It does not specify that it cannot be the breathable lotion. So the printable coupons do say that we can't redeem those on the breathable. But from the 131 Smart Source, that coupon just says on any lotion. It excludes trial and travel. It did work on this item. And then Ibotta gave me $2 back and Dabble gave me 30 cents back. So my final cost ended up being just $1.18. I have never picked up CLR. Have you guys used this? Tell me if it's any good. So this is the sports stain remover and it's 22 ounces. I don't know if you can see that. There we go. So you want to grab specifically the sports stain remover and it is priced at $3.24 at my store. It was in the wrong spot. So be sure if you're if you're questioning the cost of an item at Walmart, be sure to use their app. There is a barcode scanner on their app and it's super convenient. So it was in the wrong spot. It looked like it was like $4.98. I scanned it on the app. It was $3.24. So Ibotta gave me two separate rebates back on this particular item, one for $1.50 and the other for a dollar. So my final cost ended up being just 74 cents didn't have any coupons, didn't need any coupons, an amazing deal. And this gigantic box of cereal, this is the Kellogg's Little Debbie Oatmeal Cream Pie Cereal. The family size 14 and a half ounce box is $3.64. The coupons app had a coupon giving me a dollar back on this item and Ibotta had a 50 cent rebate and Ibotta also had a 50 cent bonus when you redeem that rebate. So my final cost ended up being just $1.64. And this made me smile when I picked it up. These little smiles, mashed potato shapes. I think those are so cute. This is the McCain variety. These are $2.28 and Fetch gave me two separate re rebates back, one for a dollar and one for 75 cents, making my final cost just 53 cents. I was happy this rebate popped up again for me. So the Rise Nitro Brewing Cold Brew Coffee is $2.88 a can. Ibotta gave me a dollar back and Fetch Rewards gave me a dollar back, making my final cost just 88 cents. The Big Soleil Simply Smooth three count razors are $3.27. Ibotta gave me $3 back, making my final cost just 27 cents. And the Maranatha Almond Butter is priced at 98 cents. Shopkick is giving us $1.30 for buying this item, making our final cost completely free plus a $0.32 cent money maker. And here were some clearance finds. So be sure to always check your clearance section every time you go to Walmart and you're couponing because this ended up a money maker. 
and I think my sister might actually use these so I have a place to donate these to. So I found one of the Clairol root touch-ups for two dollars and I'll share this with you guys in case your store is also selling these for two dollars. So let me hide the barcode for you guys. Okay, and then it is the 4R, the dark auburn reddish brown shade. So this is Rude Touch Up, and that was marked at $2. This wasn't marked, so I scanned it on the app, and it showed up as being $1.75. So this is the 5RB medium reddish brown, clear all, nice and easy, permanent, and... Here's the barcode from that one for you guys. So my store actually had a ton of um, hair care marked down and I didn't have any rebates on these, but I did have a $5 off of two Clairol hair care printable. So one was $2, one was $1.75. My final cost was $3.75 for the pair of them. And then I used that $5 off of two coupon. And I bought a did have a 10 cents on any brand hair color rebate. So I did get that. So my final cost was completely free for both of these plus a dollar 35 moneymaker. This is why it's great to check your clearance. Even if you would never use this hair care, I personally don't color my hair. Um, so I mean, this is not something I would even use, but they gave me a dollar 35 for taking these items out of the store. So this is how rebate shopping and couponing can be super helpful. Um, and I was so happy, happy to have those printables. Now there were also some Garnier, I think it's called Olia, O-L-I-A hair color that were marked down in my store. We do have an Ibotta rebate on those. So if that's an item that you would use, you might wanna check out your store and see if yours are on sale as well. So let me share with you guys my receipt. I think we made it through everything. Um, I think the mentholatum, those coupons were the only ones that gave me trouble. Everything else worked out totally fine. So my subtotal was $50.74 before tax for 24 items. And Ibotta gave me 40 dollars and 98 cents back that right there is incredible and then fetch gave me seven dollars and 55 cents back shopkick gave me two dollars and 66 cents back dabble gave me 30 cents back and the coupons app gave me a dollar back making my final cost completely free plus a dollar 75 money maker I just love shopping at Walmart for that reason. I absolutely love it. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Drop a comment, say hi down below. I love hearing from you guys. Thank you again so, so much for watching. And until next time, guys, happy couponing.